Welcome to our tech troubleshooting session. Today, we're addressing a puzzling issue that one of our viewers has encountered with their React Native app. They've been using a web view to display an HTTPS site, but recently it started returning a blank screen. Let's dive into the details of this intriguing problem. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll go through your question, go through the answers for it, and hopefully that brings you to your solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy to get through that solution just like me. And let's get started. Let's start by understanding the issue with your React Native web view. It seems that the web view is returning a blank screen for certain websites on your device, while others work perfectly. First, check if there are any settings or apps on your LG G4 that might be interfering with the web view. Sometimes security apps or settings can block certain content. Next, ensure that your web view implementation is up to date. You can do this by updating the React Native web view package in your project. Additionally, consider testing your app on different devices or emulators. This can help determine if the issue is specific to your LG G4 or if it occurs on other devices as well. Finally, if the problem persists, you might want to check the network settings on your device. Sometimes, DNS issues can cause certain websites to fail to load in WebView. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're seeing a blank screen in Android WebView, it might be due to a private SSL error in development mode. Check your console log for a specific error message about the certificate chain. To resolve this, you can add a prop called Ignore SSL Error Set to True. This will allow the web view to load the website even with the SSL error. For more details, you can refer to the GitHub pull request linked in the description. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If you're facing a blank screen in Android WebView, First, check your SSL certificate using a tool like DigiCert. If it's not trusted, you may need to add missing intermediate certificates on your server. If you can't access the server, consider a workaround. To implement a workaround, create a network security configuration file. This involves adding a custom certificate authority to your app's configuration. In the configuration file, specify your domain and trust anchors. Replace example.com with your actual domain. Next, download the certificate from your browser. On Chrome, click the lock icon, view the certificate, and export it in DER format. Use OpenSSL to convert the downloaded certificate to PEM format. If you don't have OpenSSL, install it using Homebrew on Mac or follow Windows instructions.
move the converted PEM file to the appropriate directory in your project. Finally, update your Android Manifat XML to include the network security configuration. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The user confirms that their WebView implementation works successfully. They provide a code snippet that shows how to set up a WebView in React Native. And that's it. I hope that that's helped find the solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. Every time you hit it, it really helps. Now, I'll see you next time. Next time you need some technical help. And until then, have a good one.